Here you have the Bergener bearing bar, a prototype of the Bergener bearing bar that's going to be uh, designed and made by Rogue Fitness Company. I think you're familiar with Rogue. Um, and Bill Henniger is the owner of that uh, firm. And he's been working to design with uh, Coach Bergener a very high quality Olympic lifting bar of a similar quality to that made by a Penlay that we're looking at or Worksand that we're also looking at. One thing you'll notice about this particular prototype bar, I believe it's also what Bill's going to choose to offer, um, at least as a version um, from Rogue, is that it has the bright zinc sleeves along with a black zinc bar. And he chose to do that for gripping reasons. Uh, the black zinc certainly has a very tacky grip to it and feels good. And the bright zinc gives a nice, clear, shiny finish on the end. If we go up close and we take a look at the inside of the sleeve, I don't know if you can really tell that from here, but basically you, you just see the bearing race and a snap ring. So this does not have that bushing that we talked about or that we're going to talk about for the, for the pin lay bearing bar. Um, it has a nice smooth spin, so let me give this a spin and let you listen to it. So that's the spin of this bar without any weight on it. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab a Worksen 10 kilo plate and I'm going to stick it on the end of this bar. can get a feel for how this works, how it rotates with the plate on it. So I'm going to give that a nice little shove, give you a chance to see the rotation, listen, it's very quiet, it's a quiet bearings in here, and then take a look at it from the other side. And I think you can see that it has a nice spin that lasts quite a bit of time with a 10 kilo plate on it. 